Hey guys, um, some of you guys know me by my more comedic stuff that I've put on YouTube, but today what I'm going to be looking at is how to fix the League of Legends not opening um, Riot client bug. I'm going to go to my launch pad and I'm going to try to click League of Legends. When I click League of Legends, first thing you're going to see is this pops up, but then I wait a few seconds and League of Legends doesn't actually open. Now my computer is pretty fast, it should have opened by now. So what I'm going to do again, just to show you guys what's actually going on. I'm going to open up Activity Monitor here, I'm going to show you guys. So as you can see, the Riot client isn't even opening up like it normally does yeah no still nothing so what I'm what I'm going to do is open a new uh, finder window here and I'm gonna type in riot client uh, this Mac I'm actually trying to open this and it is not working and the report crashes up high again so it seems to be repeatedly crashing so what I'm going to be doing instead is I'm going to be moving this to the trash and then I'm going to force the League of Legends to try an update Launchpad, League of Legends. Now League of Legends should actually open. Their League of Legends is actually opening now. Because, first of all, League of Legends doesn't refer to the right client app, but if the right client doesn't work, it will open on its own. I'm going to just click restart. Hopefully it will restart and actually sync it. Oh, I, I can tell that's repairing the client. Cool, now we're just going to wait for the client to repair itself, and it should do the trick. Now in the meantime, what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk about what happens if, uh, new window, what happens if League of Legends is not able to update on its own. So what you want to do is you want to go to leagueoflegends.com or wherever you would normally download League of Legends from. And you can see here in, in the background, uh, you can see League of Legends is opening up uh, and it's trying to actually fix the issue. And now I don't think League of Legends will actually be successful. I've tried this before and it hasn't worked in the past. Yeah, okay, I'm going to try to log in and see if this works. It's probably not going to work. Yep, it does not work. So this fix did not work. I'm going to sign out of this. Now what I'm going to go do is I'm going to go download League of Legends. So I'm going to click play for free. And I'm going to click already registered. So I'm going to click to download instead. Download for Mac. It's downloading. Okay, great. And now what I'm going to go do is I'm going to open install League of Legends. Open League of Legends. Yep, I'm going to open it. Now I'm going to click install. Now it says 10.6 gigabytes, right? I've metered this. And I've checked it out. It, it, it won't actually install all 10.6 gigabytes of League of Legends. What it'll do, it'll try to install it in the path that it last installed at. Assuming you've done a default installation, this option does not work for people who have done a custom installation and installed it elsewhere. I believe if you've installed it elsewhere, you might need to explore your advanced options, um, which I'm not going to be covering in this video. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to click install. And what it's going to do is it's going to find the path that it, it should be installed in, which is the default path that it goes to uh, under applications and app data, after which uh, it will see that most of the files are there. I'm going to click install. Most of the files are there. And you saw for a split second it said repairing. And now it's installing only 236 megabytes of files instead of the whole 10.6 gigabytes. Now the reason it's doing that is because most of the files are already there. I, I have to probably go launch it now. So I'm, I'm going to go launch League of Legends now. See how this is doing in the meantime. So, okay, right now the Riot client actually popped up here. Now we've actually got a Riot client. Okay, cool. So we've access to the Riot client again, something that wasn't occurring before. And now it's going to open up actual League of Legends. But now this pretty much fixes the bug that has been occurring for the past, I believe, eight, nine months when this video has been made. Or maybe even over a year now, where, where when, when I open League of Legends. See, now you can see the little Riot icon in the corner would pop up here and then it would just disappear. Obviously, it wasn't occurring in this situation, but uh, like I could still tell that like the report crash function was going off in activity monitor, which signaled to me that like, okay, like clearly the Riot client is still crashing because I knew from before that it had a bad habit of crash. And now I'm officially into League of Legends. I'm able to play the game. I didn't have to download much of anything. This is how you fix the Riot client or League of Legends bug on Mac. I'm running a Mac mini. I'm gonna open my specs right here. I'm currently running a Mac mini on the Apple M1 chip. This was actually occurring even before I got the M1 chip. This is not specific to the M1 chip. I know some people will be quick to jump on the fact that this is new and that's why it might be causing issues. This was occurring even on my old Mac Mini. It did not occur on my MacBook, so I believe it might have something to do with the Mac Mini series, but it might be occurring for you on your Mac. Um, unfortunately, I don't really have a fix for Windows computers. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video helped you a lot, um, and I will be putting out more content like this in the future as I run into more problems and with no apparent fixes online in the future. And I hope, I sincerely hope, this bug does get handled. Thank you so much, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.